We are just 24 hours away from the Mayans MC Season 5, the final raid, and it will literally be the final raid for five people on this list. Welcome back, guys, to Fog Entertainment. All Out War is going on. We've got the Mayans, we've got the Sons of Anarchy, we've got the Cartel, we've got other groups that have just been formed. Everybody is fighting. A lot of men are going to die in this final season, but also some women will bite the dust as well and we've compiled a list here of five women most likely to die in this season of the Mayans MC. So without any further wait let's get into it. Number five we have got Sophia. Now why have we got Sophia? Plain and simple she is hanging around with easy. She is probably the most likely person to just catch a stray bullet or just catch a bunch of stray bullets. Now I'm not saying that there's anyone in particular that will be trying to kill Sophia, but when you're joint to the hip with Easy, when you're sharing a bed with Easy, when you're sharing a caravan with Easy, if you share any sort of personal space with Easy, then you're gonna have a target literally on your back, on your chest, on your head, because Easy is a wanted man. And I think Sophia could die. Like I said, she doesn't necessarily have any enemies, but she is with Easy, and he's got a shitload of enemies, so I'm putting Sophia in at number five. Moving in at number four, we've got Jess. And you know what? She pretty much started this whole thing. Jess is the one that discovered Montez's body. She went to the sons, she told them about his cut and the fact that he was dead. And then she fed them information about where the Mayans would be. And she's pretty much been working for the Mayans in their clubhouse, but been feeding a shitload of information to the sons. So you could say that Jess is responsible for a lot of people dying. And I think it's only fair that she will now die in season five. She's got blood on her hands. Now it's time for her to get her own blood all over her body. Moving into number three, we've got Jasmine, the old lady of Terry. Now she's not actually that old, so if you'd rather call her Terry's girlfriend, then that is perfectly fine. But I think she will die in season five. Now we can see from the trailer that she does get physical. She like jumps on a member of the mines. I'm not too sure which member it is, but we do see Jasmine like grappling with someone on the floor. So she definitely looks like she is a, a stand by your man type of girl. I think she's definitely a ride or die bitch, and I think she will be with Terry till the very end. But the problem is, Terry is on the side of Sam Dino, and in my opinion, that is the losing side. So if you're on that side, you're probably going to lose. And I think Jasmine will go down this season, basically just due to the fact that she is Terry's girlfriend. She will be, be beside him, and uh, yeah, she is likely to not make it out of season five. Moving in at number two, we have Nails. Now we all know Nails' unfortunate story in season four. Lost the baby with Angel and then she lost Angel to Adelita as he went in his selfish ways and got with his, his new family. And I guess we shouldn't expect anything less than Angel. You know, what we've seen throughout the entire series, even though Angel can at times be a good person, he can't be kind-hearted, he can be a selfish bastard too though, and he can't really keep his dick in his pants. And we've seen this, he even slept with Letty after Coco's death, which was pretty unforgivable in my opinion. So yeah, Angel, when that snake in his pants is activated, he will pretty much latch on to anything. And I do feel like Nails could be the unfortunate one out of Angel's, let's call it, extended family to die because we do see that he's very angry in season 5, that he says that they came after my family. I don't think Adelita's going to die. I don't think Angel's son is going to die. So therefore, I believe it, it could be Nails. And uh, maybe Angel will feel a bit of guilt. Maybe he'll feel a bit of remorse if Nails dies. Now, it could be a shootout in the, the clubhouse. You could die that way. Or maybe someone could from the Suns could kill Nails, thinking that her and Angel are still together. They could be trying to get at Angel by killing Nails, and they're not aware of Adelita and Angel's new relationship. Because let's be honest, these relationships change every five minutes. So yeah, I think Nails will unfortunately die. 
She doesn't really have much outside of Angel. Once she lost the baby, and then she lost the relationship with Angel, she's living on borrowed time. She doesn't really have much in the way of family or in the way of friends. So she's kind of like the odd one out. I think Nails will go in season five. And speaking of going in season five, that takes us on to number one in the list. And it is Hope. And the reason why Hope's number one is because you could argue out of all the women in Mayans MC, she actually has a legit enemy. And that enemy seems to be more ruthless, seems to be more badass, seems to be more terrifying than ever. And he is Isaac Packer, and he's coming for vengeance. He is coming to annihilate everybody in his path. And I think one of those people in his path will be Hope. We know how the whole thing with Coco played out. Hope basically rescued by Coco from Meth Mountain. I don't think Isaac's going to let that one slip. He, he didn't get a chance to kill Coco in Season 4, but I do believe he will get a chance to kill Hope in Season 5. He could also be after Letty as well. They're both very connected to Coco, but the reason why I think out of the two, I think Hope is more likely to die, is because I feel like Letty is sort of connected more to the Mayans. I feel like the Mayans, when push comes to shove, they will look at Letty more like a blood relative, more like a little sister, whereas I just don't feel like Hope has that connection to the rest of the Mayans. I feel like Hope's connection was to Coco, and once Coco went, we haven't really seen Hope interact with any of the Mayans. She wasn't even at Coco's funeral, so I feel like there is more for Letty. I feel like there is more stories and just more of a reason for Letty to survive than there is for Hope. So unfortunately, guys, I think Hope will be the one to die out of that duel in Season 5, and probably at the hands of Isaac. Could she even sacrifice herself to save Letty? I think that's another possibility. But that's it guys, five women that will die in this season's Mayans MC, season five, the final ride. Will I be correct? I've got a feeling I will. I've got a feeling all five of these women will die. Who knows? I'll come back to this video after everything ends and we'll see just how correct I got it. Or did I get it totally incorrect? We'll find out guys, 10 episodes ahead of us. Cannot wait, the final ride. Mine's season 5. And hopefully it's a good one. I'll catch you in the next video guys. Till next time though, peace.